All right. Hi. All right, guys, this is the Frank Crate of the Month. This is our, wow, 13th Frank Crate. Real quick, while Frank takes the letter I was gonna read, the beer of the month is, it's, a, it's an oldie but a goodie. It's a Sierra favorite. Nevada I think, it's been the beer, I think it's been the beer of the month now three times. Yeah, Sierra well, Nevada I love Sierra Nevadas. All right, we got a letter first. It's to both of us. It's from uh, R. Allard in Connecticut. Okay. Patrick and Frank, last month I sent Frank a copy of Life and Death of Superman. Hope you enjoyed the novel, whether you read it or not. Yes, I did. I always appreciate the effort and that you're, everybody's so nice to me. Since I heard he is a fellow Batman fan like myself, he should have a copy of Batman Year One. Don't know if he is also a fan of Frank Miller, but Frank's Pat friend should have a ball reading it. Also, you can give a shout out to a couple of friends of mine, Sean and his uncle Lewis. Uncle and his Lewis. Uncle Lewis and to my brother, oh, brother Gregory, Gregory and his wife right. Melanie. Okay. So we're gonna hi, say hi Sean. to Sean. Hi Uncle so, Lewis. Uncle Lou, hi Gregory Greg, and, and Melanie. Of course. Have a good time. And uh, yeah. And I do love uh, Batman Year One. I actually I think I have that. I. I, well, I, I liked all those uh, continuous Batmans uh, in the 90, 80s and 90s. Uh, well, very looks dark. like you just sent it, Frank. No, that's very cool. Uh, no, actually, I don't have this. You and I love one? Frank Miller. Uh, the Frank... What? I want to see what's left. I'm going to get to that. <laughs> I love Frank Miller, and I like the Frank Miller Daredevil also, and Batman. He has a very cool sense. Oh, now, also, he did uh, Sin City, right? Uh, yes, he did. Yes, so I'm, I'm a total fan of his. All right, let's get on with the letter. P.S. Two quick questions for Frank and Pat. Frank, I know you're a beer dude, but what do you think of the other alcoholic drinks? Mike, Smirnoff, and Twisted Tea. No, no, and no. I, I, I like a mixed the, drink like once in a while, stuff. and I like beer, but I, I'm not into these at all. Not to say you shouldn't drink them, but I don't like them. Pat. Have you considered checking out thrift shops for retro games as an alternative to I, flea markets? I have done it before. It's harder nowadays. I mean, you have a couple of, you have a few ones that you can go to. You have Goodwill, but they put a lot of their stuff online now. There you go, Frank. Do you have it or not? You weren't sure if you had the Batman Year One? It's excellent. I have it in case you want to borrow it. I, I might have it. This is a compositor. This is the only way it showed up. No, they originally had issues, but this was. Yeah, uh, I might have the issues, but this is great. I always, uh, no, I appreciate this, and I always appreciate well, have you read it, it written it's, it's maybe excellent. years ago when I okay. first bought it. All right, so back to back to the question. Uh, so you got, you have like good, Goodwill, as Frank checks his phone. Ooh, and he calls me rude while we're doing that at dinner. So anyway. We're already so, on the friggin' internet, aren't we? So we're supposed to be doing this. I'm trying to, I'm trying to blend in. That's not the internet, that's phone communication. I'm trying to blend in and be just as rude as you guys when someone's talking oh, to you and you, and you look at audience. your phone. Don't insult the audience. No, I'm trying to like steer him, like nudge him in the right direction. So, all right. so you got like Goodwill you can go to, you got Salvation Army to check out, you have stuff like, um, uh, well we have the one Zed that helps out the veterans here uh, locally. We Goodwill. Have no, uh, uh, well. Amvet. Amvet. Uh, so you can check those out. I found stuff about like 15 years ago. I found my big box uh, uh, Rob actually at a thrift store back in like I think it was like Sea Warren, New Jersey. Remember Sea Warren? Remember that town? No. Or or Keyport. It was Keyport. Keyport. I know. Keyport. Yeah. Keyport. Sea Warren. Uh, anyway, so anyways, yeah, that's that's what you could uh, that's what God. you can try. There's uh, always a town in New Jersey, New Jersey. I never heard of. Uh, which Frank. is weird. This is for you as well. Oh, is it? I don't see where. Oh, it doesn't know who it's from. There you go. Pawn sacrifice. It. Toby McGuire. Peter Sandsen guard. Liv Schreiber. Liv Schreiber. And want. it looks like a, uh, a a a chess battle in the oh. Cold War. Uh, and then here's some notes. Gift for you. Oh, it's about. Oh, it's when he plays, uh, plays Bobby Fischer, Toby McGuire. Yeah. You no, find? that's that's great. I I was uh, a big chess guy right at that era, and on uh, since there was only like seven channels and no internet, we could watch the chess match between Fisher and Spassky unfold live on KPBS. They had the board where the actual moves were, and then they had chess experts talking about every move in between them. All right, I was totally fascinated, even though I'm like you know. Frank tosses aside. We're having trouble this month with the letters, Frank. Hello, yeah, Pat okay. and Frank. 
I've been watching the Frank Crate unboxings since the beginning, so I decided to contribute a little something for all the great videos you put out. Thank you. I really enjoyed this movie. Hope you do as well. From Link 2. And it's a, and it's a new copy, too. Yeah, so it's great. A, and I love the whole Bobby Fischer thing. It's like unbelievable. I love Leo Schreiber. Um, so there, thanks a lot. We and got... I know the outcome, but I don't care. Uh, there, you know, there's a great movie that you know the outcome, and it's totally riveting. It's called All the President's Men, and it's about the Watergate investigation. investigation. And even though you know what's going to happen, you're like riveted the entire Actually, time. Actually, let me give you this one to open first. We have three more. That one, that one, and that one. All right. How about this one? Go for it, Frank. Okay. Context we love are from... Uh, I love the little notes. You see... I love to see. This is something you can. This have. is from. This is from Patrick, not my Patrick, from Alexandria, Virginia. He says stuff before. There you yeah. go, Frank. Help me open this. Okay. You got envelopes. You got a letter for me. I'll and it looks like a game. It's called Bird Watching Birdopoly, which God, you guys really know me. Oh. It's a bird oh, watching wow. version of Monopoly. Oh. How cool. This is a long okay. letter. I'm definitely reading this. I am actually going to never ask for another Christmas present from anyone my entire life. <laughs> uh, I Really. Uh, you guys are just too much. I, I, can't get, I cannot get over it. Flight school. The Ruby Throated Hummingbird. You ever, th ever see one of those? Yes. Ones? They're, All they're, right. Yeah. Dear Frank and Pat. We have other things here to open too. I just want to say hi again. Frank, I know you want to wrap, wrap me in bubble wrap. Uh, I know you like birds and board games, so what better than Birdopoly? I hope you Bird enjoy. Board game. I must admit that watching Frank unboxing the Luke Cage with Pat is quickly becoming my most anticipated video each month. Wow. Pure Jeez. entertainment. A little extra for both of you. Frank, I know you love the Yankees. Uh-oh. Yeah. Open it, open it before I get to the line, Frank. Okay. So I wanted to give you a... 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 Just give me a chance a, here. <laughs> Jerk off. Hey, language. Speaking of hey, uh, a Bernie Williams oh, card. Oh, God, you're kidding me. Pat, I know you love the Giants. So here is the football a, Giants, I hope it is. Yeah, not, <laughs> not the New York Giants from 50 years ago. Or well, the, that would be good because it'd be worth it. I want to give you an Odell Beckham Jr. autograph card. Thank you. Oh, that's great. No, this is actually way too much. They have serial numbers to show their print runs. There was only 99 of these made, and that one there was only a certain Yeah, Bernie number. was... Um, Bernie goes boom. When they talk about the core four, they should be caught talking about the core five, because Bernie was a, a, a part of every one of those if, World Series teams, a great guy, and a good jazz guitarist also. Oh, yeah, this... Thank and, you and, so much. And, and Beckham, even though yeah. he had his, that bad game where he All went right. headhunted, uh, Beckham has a chance to be one of the greatest wide receivers ever. All right, this is like age. better than Christmas. I got a board game and that? a baseball so these card. Are, this was only Will. And a movie about chess about Bobby Fischer. This is number Ryan. one of 50. This was the first one printed, Frank. Let's put it on eBay. No, I'm kidding. This is fantastic. Well, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. We'll see if it's worth 100 bucks more. No, I'm kidding. That's great. Oh, there's more. No. Uh, enjoy. Advice. Don't display the signed cards as any light will destroy the signature over time. Oh, you got to put it in a protective thing, Frank. All right, I'll, I'll it, put it in my the drawer with the, the magazines. I went, oh, no, I can... You know. There's a second one, a second note. Thanks again, Frank and Pat. You're the best. Next time you hear from me, I'll be in Las Vegas where I'm moving to. Take care. All, All right. right, hop, skip, and a jump. Vegas, lots of cheap... Uh, Cheap oh, real no, estate. The guy next door got his Comic Con tickets already. Oh, did you get yours? I got a I got a register for my my uh, pro pass. Thanks. Yeah, <laughs> couldn't you get me in for free? Is your well, I, no, I can't get you for free. You have to pay. Why? Because you only get one free one for professional. All right, friend, we got a couple. Yeah, but more. I'm your like your Pumping man. Up. I'm your man. Your your <laughs> bodyguard. What, what what are we doing? This. You're open that. Frank. Oh, okay. So you have to direct. You yeah. guys can play I'm too pushy with Frank. I have to direct this or else. <laughs> we don't know where Wow, we're what a cool card. Look at that. It's all backwards. It's from the nerdery of Southeast Texas. Very cool. Love the card. That's worth the price, even if you didn't put oh. anything else in there. You didn't want to show the phone number, Frank. It's uh, uh, Mike and Jennifer, <laughs> and it's pronounced Suet. And it's the coolest card yeah. ever. Because it, it has glasses. I'll cover. No, it's backwards, but, too. It's got glasses. I'll, and look at this. I'll, look cover, at the, the, no, I'll cover the phone cool. number, but you can look it up. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> And what do we got here? This is for you, Pat. They're at Etsy.com slash 
Set X Nerdery. S-E-T-X Nerdery. And they're so nice, they even gave something for Ian. Oh, you know. you know what? We'll open this on the podcast for Ian. You can open yours, and I'll open these for Ian. Yeah, okay. We'll keep them. We'll keep them. You even the got podcast. something for Ian. Ian, even though he doesn't deserve anything. <laughs> Ooh, no, come shots on. fired. We kid because we care. No, we kind of do. Okay. Well, I do. I don't know about you. <laughs> My husband and I wanted to thank you. Oh, I love the girl. See the look how beautiful handwriting. Oh, uh, I wanted to thank you for the videos that you are in and for making us laugh. We know that you like to cook, so we wanted to send you a couple of regional favorites of ours from Southeast Texas. Great! Yeah, I love, yeah. I, I, I love uh, that kind of cooking. It, I, I'm guessing it's, bar I'm hoping it's barbecue. Okay, both of the steak seasonings, perfect, and the coffee are made locally. You know I like coffee too. We hope to enjoy, hope you, you enjoy, enjoy and, and that, that you keep making videos with Pat. <laughs> yeah, he has to twist my arm, but I'm in it. Thanks, Mike and Jennifer. All right, let's open it And up. I love the written note. I love the handwriting is so cool. And let's see what we got here. Well, we already said what you got from there. But yeah, you got but let's seasoning. see it. Ooh, oh, X Joy steak. I love the barbecue. You right. know, besides Italian food, it's my. You know, it's authentic because it's like a really simple. It's like a really simple. Oh you know, God. Good. And see coffee. coffee. You know me. I'm a total so coffee drinker. There you go. Uh, oh, couldn't survive without it. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, like and I said, I'm never gonna ask for another thing for Christmas in my entire life ever. I'll keep. I'll, you guys, I'll hold are, you to that. You and, can. And, and, and this Mike, is Mike, too too nice. Mike of and you. Jennifer. Too nice of you. Mike and Jennifer. Uh, I'll open mine with Frank. Uh, with Frank. With Ian. I, I've never confused you two before. Never will again. I'll open mine with Ian on the podcast in the future. And then you have one more, Frank. Can't wait to try him. Uh, uh, try this seasoning. I wonder if I can I can use it on a beef roast too, which I think I might do for Easter. I'm gonna read this one, Frank. Oh, mesquite shake they got too. Whoa. Hello, Frank. Uh, this is from uh, this is from Hector. Hector uh, Ruiz. Yeah, I was gonna say. I know I sent you the, the cassette version of this, but I thought I'd send you an upgrade on vinyl. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh God. There you go, Frank. Inagata de Vida. Like one of the early, Iron butterfly. yeah, the late 60s, early 70s, when people started to go a little wacky. And uh, this is unbelievably cool. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to say. Uh, you guys are just too nice to me, and that's all I can say about it. Way too nice. All right. I'm misting up here. Oh. I hope you. I think that's from the stuff you were doing before. Yeah, I, that could I, be too. I hope you like it and hope it finds a good home in your collection. Why am I sending you this? You may ask. Cause fuck it, that's why. Ha ha. That's the best reason well, to do anything, cause yeah. you want to do it. <laughs> I just love Pat's channel, and you guys always make my day. If Pat is reading this, you have a special gift coming your way on the podcast. Oh, yes, it is Nintendo related and fun. Smiley face. Thanks for all your great entertainment and fun videos. Cheers, uh, Hector Linko. Linko. P.S. I hope this letter didn't get ripped apart again from Frank's blade. Ah, ah hey. hey! He's on you, Frank. Hey. Uh, so this is great. You got the burning. No, this is like this too is much. This is number one of 50 for the burning no, part. No, it's just too much. This is fantastic. And, and I and love the handwritten note, especially and a, and ladies, got, the Pat, way ladies write. They're Pat, always so neat. And Pat made out with the card. And you got steak seasoning. No, that's, that's something yeah, that, yeah. Let, we're, we're gonna rip open that birdopoly and play that. We should do. We should do the board game uh, let's play series. Remember, we should actually do that. Would you guys yeah, want to see us play board think, games? Yeah, we have a couple of shows in mind. Me doing a cooking show, a board game show, and then I don't know something. I am so old now and I in pain <laughs> that I need you know like money. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. Come on. How about a Frank, a Frank Patreon? When people want a Frank Patreon? What's that? It's, it's people who give you money to produce material each month. If you do that, would you do a board game video like at least once a month? I don't people, know. I, I, I feel like, you don't be like I don't feel be like any money or anything I get from this, I'm I'm like stealing from someone. Oh, I really no. do. Come on. Because it's not like product that I'm used to making, like someone's <laughs> garden or doing a clean up. 
or fixing someone's it's, irrigation. But it's entertainment. It's like if you're acting. I understand that, but I'm, I haven't right. gotten there okay. yet. I just don't All think right. I'm a. Pro I'm not a professional. I'm just a gardener. <laughs> no one on YouTube is professional. Anyway. Well, so then they shouldn't get any money ever. So, <laughs> if you want to send us stuff for future Frank Crates to see us on Open It, hopefully, and well, we're, we're goofy. We're always yeah. Goofy. It's the the address is Frank Crate Care Pat Country, PO Box seven six nine five, San Diego, California nine two one six seven. We're gonna go grab a burger while it's still happy hour. Thanks so much for all your gifts. Yes, and can't thank, thank you enough. And thanks for uh, you know this is our thirteenth Frank Crate. We've been doing really? this for a year already. And Frank, Frank actually, he, he, he gets a little emotional sometimes thinking about what you guys send him, you know. Yeah, I, I can't believe it. So, yeah, thank people, you so people much. People stop on the street sometimes uh, and I say know. hi to him. And so we'll, I'm just hope I don't get hurt. No, they won't. We're, we're <laughs> going to get you out to a convention uh, this year, too. We're going to try to do that. Oh, God. All right. We'll see you later. Jesus. Okay, see you guys.